Oh, all right, all right, all right. Ready? Yeah. So, and then once you're in the gas line, I'm all in the water. Ready, guys? Yeah. All right, let me start with that. Spooski the Bull, HB and Joe, got a special guest with us. White boy, <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Taco Tuesday himself. What's up? Huh? What's up, Kurt? We already yeah. break the internet with this one, huh? Bringing cuz outside his element, man. Yeah, I ain't never did no interview with that before. Or you gotta tell people a little bit about yourself, what you be getting into. Like they, 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 they see your face, they know what you be doing, but you gotta tell them what you, what you want, bro. So, you know, I've been out here hosting, promoting. Got a couple different spots I'm at, a couple different locations. Mirage, Roar, Room Service. Yeah. Where Mirage located at? Room Service located at? Uh, Mirage is on South Street. Exactly the dress uh, It's like, like second, first, first and second, and yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Out of town, you might want to come through. Mm -hmm. uh, room service, fourteen thirty nine. Uh, Roar, that's Delaware Ave, right mm -hmm. next to the casino. Right. Mm -hmm. How you uh like speak on that too a little bit? Like these, these are all Philly locations too for the people that don't know that's watching. It's like you're from Canada. How you uh? Like how you really like jump into that that scene with like the Philly people and like even being able to really even have like a consistent movement over there? I mean, <clears throat> I guess it's relationships and shit, you feel me? Like, they seen something I did and I ain't never really hosted promote before, you feel me? I did a lot of block parties and shit. Um, hanging over there. They seen that I could bring a crowd, I guess, or something, you feel me? They seen and where that, that shit came from, like, just, like, going there partying for real? Yeah, just partying. The first time I really, I've been actually with Mirage for, like, three birthdays now, you feel me? Mm -hmm. It was my third birthday. Um, it's my third birthday over there and shit. They treat me good, though, but uh, me, and, me and my brother Pete went in there and shit and said, Yo, we gonna have a party here, but we want the whole drum. Yeah. They looking at us like, yo. Well, what you what you did that like on some like unintentional shit? Like, I, like you just it was my show. birthday. And yeah, you we did all the sections. Yeah, I just figured like I know people gonna pull up for me and shit. Like, yeah. so let me get all this, and they looking like, man, ain't nobody ever asked for all this. Like, you right. tripping. Mm -hmm. So I'm like, yo, I, I got I got it. You feel me? I'ma handle it. So. And they looked at that like on some eye opening shit, like, oh shit, this nigga coming yeah, different. Right. Ain't so nobody even look at like it. Like I feel as though, because. Yeah, it was just, yeah, we just was going to come and have a yeah, party. How like, we do it. That's how we do like, every time. Like, yeah, like, yeah, I wasn't like, looking for business. Like, mm -hmm. I ain't hacked up for nothing. I just, yeah. you know what I mean? If you're going to look out on anything, look I'm on some regular shit. Bottles, so, yeah. You feel me? <clears throat> so we, 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 we did our thing that day or whatever. Of course, like I said, relationship, we built a relationship after that. Actually, I know I'm. Taking trips in Miami with these guys and shit, you feel me? Yeah. Nice After we came back, niggas offered me like, "Yo, what's up? You want, you want to do something?" They offered me Tuesdays and shit. I told them I ain't know if I was ready or whatever. They was like, "You gonna do good?" You know, that's a good. Uh, you feel me? So it's like the shit, like unintentionally, like like chose you then there, like party like then. I mean, like party promoter, like then there, like chose you, like they just picked you up for. Real. Right. And I feel as though that's where the, that's where the that's where. That's where people do their best at when when it's when it come naturally. Like it wasn't like some shit he planted doing. They come yeah, naturally, yeah. and he just, just fucking with it. And he with see, it. now that shit turned into not one spot, not two spots. Cause I got like three different little spots. The situation. Now, how, you, how you get into all the other spots though? Like it was the same shit. Or you once you got shit. Mirage, you was on some shit. Like all right, let me start doing it other places. So, I um, <clears throat> one of my another relationship I built over there with my uh. People's munch and shit. Yeah. He put me on some other spots like Seven Elements and uh, Reserve. Yeah. Seven Elements ended up working for him. You feel me? Uh, Reserve, we still cool with them, but it didn't really work out. So, you know, I, I did. Uh, I had to take people somewhere after 
Mirage. After Mirage. Yeah, like, where, like party, you know, they, they closed yeah, yeah, at like, two, so yeah. I end up <clears throat> hanging out at uh, Crown. I've been there a couple of times. So, uh, built a relationship with, with the brother Dave over there. He, uh, he used to let me bring my people in afterwards, so, you know, that was cool, whatever. Then, uh, what else? You know, they end up shutting down or whatever for a little while. He got a new spot now called Prestige or whatever. So, they back and running or whatever. But, um, now when he <coughs> shut down, I ain't got nowhere to really take the people. Yeah. So, uh, I go talk to the brothers at room service or whatever. Where they, you know what I mean? Really, not even I. Relationship again, motherfucking uh, DJ Stacks. He like, yo, what's up? Put me a white boy on, you feel me? So, them brothers actually uh, opened up the doors on Tuesday where they didn't have to. You feel me? Like, they not even open during the week. Right. They they uh, they a Thursday to Sunday motion. You feel me? Right. So, just them doing that was like, you know what I mean? It was I was very appreciative. You know what I mean? So. That's another, that's how I built that. So at Mirage, what you got, uh, Tuesdays or what else? I got Tuesdays and then, um, you know, Mirage and Roar, they kind of won, but and I'm going to have Fridays over there, me and Fresco. Oh, all right. Okay, Fridays good. over there. Mm, okay, okay. And now you doing this because what you, what you, like, what you, what you expect to get out of this? Like, where you see yourself in the future, like a year or two from now? Like, what you trying to get out of this? Like, I want to, I want to bring artists in and then hopefully one day have my own little lounge. Okay. okay. You don't want to go club, you want to go straight lounge. I mean, it's a lot of work in, it, for all of that, you feel me? And you got you got to be ready. Yeah. A club is, a, you got to be ready. It's, it's, you know what I mean? I feel like club more like, club more like entertainment. Lounge is like you come kick it, chill how you want right. to chill for real. Mm-hmm. Exactly. And either or, I feel like you can bring an artist to a lounge too. You can, you're on just on doing a right. walkthrough. Like, we're going to play your music. You come through, get a section right quick, chill for right. an hour, and go about your business. Right. Everybody happy. Yeah, I, you know feel like, I feel like lounges, like, you get a little bit more longevity, a tiny bit, just due to the fact that, like, a motherfucker might come through. Yeah. And, yeah, I want all the sections. Mm-hmm. You feel know I me? Mean? This might just be his private party, or like, I feel like lounges and artists kind of work hand in hand with yeah. the yeah. listening parties, yeah. all types of cool Like you said, I think loun- lounges got more longevity. I feel like clubs, like, you notice a club they had like 10 different, done, like, yeah, had like 10 different names. Like, we known clubs had 10 different owners, 10 different names. Yeah. Like, lounges be cool under the radar. You keep that thing yeah. a steady flow. But Which cuz got like they they flow crazy like them yeah. the little Tuesdays them should be nice bro like yeah, you, you might go there on a Friday it, Saturday it, it, should Tuesday be Tuesday just be starter they, that and this is all off week. like not even like not like this is off bro though like man, this yeah. off bro like cause they like, flow all week and they got listen I, I do good on Tuesday but man the lineup for promoters is is good like you got mm-hmm. Fresco right at the y'all got the right t- y'all got the right team you got PC and the bones in them mm-hmm. on Fridays mm-hmm. you feel me. You got uh, the Joshes on Sundays. You feel me? Both Joshes. So it's the lineup is crazy anyway. Like when you mm-hmm. them type of promoters, you got them names all week. You, of course, you're going to get people up in there. Uh, it'd be like Mirage. It'd be like, you can just stop by on a random night. It's, like, it's going on in the Mirage. Right. Like, Grab a little. And then yeah, how we got it. Like, we like family in there. Yeah. So we go through. We go through yeah. there. Just to, It might be late now. I might go grab some some some, some lamb chops yeah, right I quick. Exactly. I'll go grab some lamb good. chops right quick and just chill. Grab a shot and slide right quick. Yeah, every time I go to Mirage, just to grab the, uh, the jerk chicken joint. Yeah. 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 Jerk chicken Alfredo. And, yeah. Yeah. Alfredo. And, and then they genuine. They genuine. They genuine dudes up in there. Like yeah, They genuine, they they nice genuine dudes body. up in there. Like They were Mirage. You never know who you about to see in there. You going to Mirage. You be PJ Tucker and them. And I be seeing Core Mirage. Absolutely. I be seeing all types of motherfuckers. Like, absolutely. PJ Tucker. PJ Tucker. And my brother Munch. <clears throat> like I said, building a relationship. Them niggas took me to the motherfucking to the game mm-hmm. That's crazy. a whole different way nigga I'm used to going yeah niggas took me through the bottom and shit I seen TNT then and that ESPN all that uh-huh. shit you feel me I'm like yo this shit live and shit you feel me we had Mirage just chilling you feel me we looked to the side P.J. Tucker right there I'm like yo what the fuck yeah he yeah. not even like he just on some street just chilling shit he passing nigga shots everything nah, he, he just on dude. some he chill dude. shit I'm like yo this crazy as hell like mm-hmm. good dude fuck it uh, right um all set what came to Mirage Offset came in That's there. What I'm saying, like, had, you never know just, who about this live, bro. Right. He just did uh, Roar last night. Him and Fresco. 
They rocked that joint. You feel me? It was, it was, it was, it was real nice. Very rare. Yeah. Yeah. Quick, quick, guys. I was gonna say like, um, like as far as like, cause I heard you say you want to do like, um, you want to bring artists out. And, uh, like you feel like walkthroughs be like worth it? Cause I feel like a lot of people be expecting like artists when they say when they come, they, they when they do a performance. I, I, I mean the the uh, the the crowd, of course, they be wanting the yeah, they be wanting the people to perform. You feel me? It's uh, uh, now it's what you pay for. Mm-hmm. Did you pay for them to just do a walkthrough, or did you did you pay for them to perform? Now, so, how many songs okay. did you pay for them to perform? You like, so what you so what you think like a, a walkthrough is like? Just come like come fuck with us like. If for like, like, oh, they for go, like a they, promoter Cause me personally um, I, I'm more so like like if I, They could really it. walk through And just keep it pushing If they want But if they fuck with you They gonna sit down What you What yeah. you right, That's so what, what you, you like, What you What you yeah. expect Out of a good walk through What would you expect Of artists to come I through I hope they would sit down and, and kick it for a second Right At least let people get some You know what I mean Some pictures yeah. or something yeah. You feel me yeah. some, some people Ain't got the time They might walk through And be on to the next motion To get that paper mm-hmm. See me I be, I mean, I be looking like, at Walk through ain't like it's cool, but it's like if I was a promoter, I wouldn't. I wouldn't pay for walk through. I'd go straight concert, bro. Like you gotta mm-hmm. give me a performance, bro. Yeah, see, that's different. That's Cause you got Cause how much walk throughs be costing for? Real? Like if you want to grab like a, like a like a, a decent type artist. Uh, it, all it all depends. It all depends. Like I, I won't do the walk through neither. Though. I ain't gonna lie. I would do the performance too. But then again, like you said, it's just, shit, like cause the yeah, rock, you might yeah. Get a performance out Cause of like here. let's say let's say we like what we do. Let's say we throw. Let's say we, you know we've been talking about we throw an event. And we can we can have somebody to come walk through and just come chill for an hour. Yeah. We cool because and then they got they got our they got the they got the clothes on and and they can get some pictures of them right quick. They sit back chilling, smoking for a little bit, interacting type shit. And go ahead, go about your business type shit. Right. But like you said, I would rather the I would rather the performance now. Cause like so, so like even at Dubai like Dubai's like it, it's like a club, but it's still give me like. Lounge for for like, it's like big, club slash it, lounge. So yeah. it's like more, it is? Uh, at Dubai. Oh Dubai! Like Dubai yeah. is like you really can get you really can get off with a walk through at Dubai because like you got the artist got to go on stage. Yeah, like, yeah. And Mirage is like artist is about to come through and really just like catch a vibe for real. Mm-hmm. So it'd be like that that joint be like type tricky. It's just it's, it, Dubai. They, that should be rolling. They, yeah. they be crowded in there. Mm-hmm. I liked it more when they had like both sides open. When they used to have the back open and shit. Yeah, I, I've been to that like a day party back there. Rolling, 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 right. Right. Had both open. Right. What? Yeah, you know what's so crazy? It'll be like, like all right, you say you you went over Philly. And That's like, where I met a boogie. Word. That, uh, that DJ Boogie from Philly. Yeah, that's how I built my relationship with him over time. here before I even went over to Philly. You feel me? That's my dog. Because I was going to ask you, I was like, all right, like you had to like damn near migrate over Philly, like to even start even like really hosting events or like even even though like you said it came to you, you had to go over to Philly. Like I just was, would you rather, rather be I, in the city? I really was going over to Philly because. It wasn't much to do no more over here. Like, yeah, as far as, like we only got Sixth Street in the yard. You know what I'm saying? Would you rather that? You feel like, me? That like, every, of course, we got Vera, but that's not ours. Yeah, like, you feel that's me? I'm still, talking about like, city I'm talking wise. City, like, city, city, right. You know what I mean? Of course, got we got much. the little bars or whatever, but it ain't you know, really at least like, the old yeah. heads, it ain't really, mm-hmm. you know what I mean? Yeah, that's what I was going to ask you. Like, so, like you wish you were in the city? Even though I'm a little older, I'm in the middle. Like, I still I fuck with the youngins too. You feel me? Like, like, so, like, it's different for me. Like I, I like to be where I'm. Where now, I'm what bro said, would you like, rather I, have something in this? Like, would you, like you, like, well, would yeah. you rather have something in the city? Like, when you do your own thing, when you wind up eventually getting your own spot or whatever, do you want that in the city or you want it over Philly or where you wanted that? Listen, I'd be appreciative to have it wherever I can have it. Right, 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 right. But um, I, I would love to do something in my city. You know, right, this where I came from. I've been right. doing a lot of different um, work and shit, and they'd be like, "Damn, I wish I could really make it work out here for like, city. Really, right. like us being right. Camden, we gotta go over fully and like then there make it happen." It's like, I mean, it's just for me. We've been, I've been going over there since we was youngest, man. We did yeah. everything over. Mm-hmm. We got a shop over there. We got to go to the club over there. We, you know what I mean? Like, mm-hmm. that's like uh, Philly, like second second nature. This Camden, right. like that's, that's right like right second there. nature. That's like going like uh-huh. that's five minutes yeah. away. Does you know, right. feel me like? They, so, that's what I be trying to tell motherfuckers and, like when I be over, over there and shit I be like y'all not far from us like yeah. it, that's like it's certain we, like it, depending on where you are in Canada you can get to Philly faster than you can get to Kramer Hill for a fucking right and that's right. what they don't understand like bro that shit right there so it's like y'all mix not really too different from what we got going on it's just like 
it's not following over the bridge. It's like we gotta go over there to get in the mix. Like, Man, it's sometimes that we can get to a food spot faster. Yeah, over yeah. here then we can go up the like highway. We, we highway. Go to, like we go to Honey Grove in <laughs> Philly instead of the one because right. it's, it's, it's then they're closer. Like right. honestly, that's what we were saying. We do that all the time. Real rap. Now, I, I, hopefully, it, it's going to spark off though because it, it is a lot of people like that mm. that like from Philly that say they fuck with like people in Camden and certain shit that's going on. It'd be a lot of motherfuckers swinging through out here for real. Like mm. they got the hotel downtown, so right. hopefully that shit transpire over here and then. They got the shit going on at Dubai. We just need some more, some lounges, mm-hmm. some some kicking spots. The yard decent. The yard. Then nice just what we doing right now? Because even what we doing right now, just creating things for the city to come have to do. Right now, we creating a we creating an audience to where as though anybody can come up here, no matter what you got going on. Like, bro, you can have you can you can sell clothes. You can you could be a rapper. You could be an entrepreneur. You can be whatever, bro. You can come up here and. And that's what it is, you know what I'm saying? We're creating a platform for the city. This in the city. We're in the city right now. Yeah, creating a platform for the city at the end of the day. Mm-hmm. There's a lot of people that want to hear what Kim Rock guys say, bro. But it's a lot of people that might even hear of him and see him a lot, but never get a chance to yeah, even, uh, like yeah. to know who he really is, which is now like they can watch this and see like get a glimpse of, of, of who Cuz is because a lot of people be having their own opinion of people and don't even be knowing the fuck. They might nah, they thanks. might they might only know you through other motherfuckers talking about you or something and they don't know the, your, who you are type. Yeah. Shit. And there's a lot of people We got a lot of people with This shit right be lined up Back to back to back to back Cause there's a lot of people That we can bring up here bro Yeah but that's how that shit be Like when um, When you put yourself out In a space where people Can give an opinion on you And not be able to like Kind of say it to you Like just have an opinion on just Oh, I know him from party promoting. I know him from podcasting. I know him from having clothes And I was like mm-hmm. I never even had a real conversation before So it's like How can you even Say anything about what you think or right, you know, like we never right. had a conversation. You probably brought something from us, or you probably paid to get in or something. But we never kicked it. So it'd be like, this this is a, a, a great space from people that is in those fields of work to come in here and talking. Like, nah, this is how I really am from. This is what I think. Absolutely. Yeah. And then, like you said, creating something from the city, like creating something from the city. So where's the way? They ain't gotta run across the bridge to go jump on the podcast. When you got one right, you got one right in your front yard. You feel me? Like why you gotta go? Cross the bridge to, to go do some other shit Like you got that shit here And people And people gotta learn How to take advantage It's like alright look For all the artists And The people that just Need that threshold if, it, if you got a party promoter That you know from your city That's at Mirage Every weekend Go in there and get your shit spent There's nothing to get a DJ $50, $60 To get your shit played Definitely mm-hmm. So it ain't nothing but conversation I feel like yeah. Us as a community We just gotta start talking more Cause we all mm-hmm. in the same room We all be Next to each other all the time, so it's like all that shit is about conversation. It's like, yo, take advantage of this podcast. Take take advantage of uh, Kenny at uh, Mirage and all these different places where the D- DJs, DJs is gonna break your fucking record for real. Like, you don't even know. Like, get your shit out there. As a rapper, you do damn near like a D. Like you want to have DJs. You want to be close. Like you want to yeah. you want to build relationships with DJs because they the, they the ones who playing the music at the end of the day. That shit should fire the Hell you know, yeah! Like know. I'm if I'm a rapper, then I that Mirage. Uh, or not. They had people come through. I ain't really sure about performance wise though. I ain't really nah, like nah. You think that shit you you think you could pull some shit off like that? And Roger is like you'll just keep it as just keeping it the vibe. I don't think it would because I don't think I don't it's know. no ain't no stage though, so yeah, it would be hard no like stage. to figure that shit out. Be looking at you like yeah, yeah, they did do they did something in the back of 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 something of what y'all did with the rap with the rappers and you know I mean they had some a rap situation in the back. Before I seen that go down the hat, but I it, I ain't see it. Up, ain't, I never seen no performance up front though. Yeah, in the back I did. But that's it. still. But like he said, yeah, roar. Yeah, but yeah. roar is still as a like. like so the, the, you know so I mean? like when whenever we thinking bigger, like whenever we thinking bigger, that's when we think of roar. Like yeah. Mirage, yeah. Is Mirage. But roar is just their cousin. Is a cousin. It's like yeah, this is all the same saying. shit. Roar like, so uh, what you can't do in Mirage is just what roar for. And roar is like roar like the uh, the Philly version of. Uh, the, Dubai for like yeah that's like and that shit like the perfect size like yeah cause it's yeah that shit like, like the perfect size cool. with a whole like what that shit hold like 2500 yeah, like I that think so, I think so yeah that's alright like that's alright right there like yeah, you holding the, 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 yeah, like, hold the event the outdoor the indoor yeah you holding the event yeah you got the you holding the event you can hold stuff 25 you gotta be able to really pack that joint out and just like really sell a fucking show for real you just gotta uh, be able to start thinking. You just gotta be able to uh, 
to sell the show. <coughs> and the motherfuckers think, <coughs> motherfuckers think, um, they uh they get a venue, put an artist on, and that shit supposed to sell. I was like, no, bro, that's not how it works. You got an artist. It's definitely you got to pick the right artist. Yeah. People and you got to be able to. People won't pull up. Like, you feel me? Like, Mm-hmm. Shit ray go off. <laughs> <laughs> Shit ray bubble. Niggas can't boy what niggas going to tell niggas when I'm when that when everything and everything cuz niggas bring emotion to the city boy. Niggas bring emotion to the city. Did you want rap? Or right, come do this interview for 10 15 minutes. Something light and then come rap. Come nigga come up here and snap cuz you mm-hmm. notice now niggas getting niggas bubbling off of niggas bubbling off of freestyles cuz you liable to you do the right freestyle, you liable to bubble cuz. Yeah. Look at boss man D-Lo. That nigga did that freestyle cuz. That nigga bubble cuz. I always tell you you got to let the music keep, like when it comes to rapping, you got to keep the music for real, like like the street shit or whatever you are trying to portray. And then they my folks going to come back this listen as you really popping it. Mhm. Right? And then you gotta be ready to do rap shit when it's time mm-hmm. to do rap shit. You gotta be ready. Like whenever all them opportunities come, you gotta be there for them shits. Cause like I said, it could be one. That shit could, it could take one thing. It could take you going to one little meeting. It could take you doing one little feature. It could take you doing, it could take you doing. Yes, you know what I'm saying? Freestyle, whatever the case may be. That shit can happen at the end of the day, cause that shit can happen. But I was just, I'm just happy we got Cuz up here though, mm-hmm. cause like I said, we got he got Cuz got a lot of people that want to hear from him. You know what I'm saying? Like a lot of people that want to hear from Cuz. Nah, in fact, they gonna be like, hey, what the fuck, bro? What they're talking about? Yeah. They're not gonna expect. They not. They don't, They probably not gonna expect like to see him just on the podcast and like they probably just know him from just doing mm-hmm. the parties at Mirage. And oh, like, I went to Mirage. Thing. I seen that nigga, but I ain't never really know what type shitty off type shit or niggas out there like what's Kenny? What, what is Kenny trying to accomplish? What the fuck he doing? What he doing and shit like. Cuz just told you Cuz trying to get his own spot That's what the fuck That's what the fuck Cuz trying to do Cause That shit went from Like you said That shit went from Not even worried about that shit I'm just out Partying and shit Niggas be saying that They go to tell you Motherfuckers Peep What the fuck going on Cuz went there To go do his party there That shit turned to a partnership Motherfuckers see how we coming That shit be regular to us and I was on the phone with my man. I was on the phone with Chuck, and I'm talking to him and shit. I'm just he just saying like, yo, I'm like, you gotta understand, cause like, shit that be regular to us don't be regular to other niggas, cause mm-hmm. like, it's a lot of shit that be regular as hell to us that don't be regular to niggas. Mm-hmm. It, that's just what be going on. And I was explaining that to Cuz and shit, like, yo, man, like, bro, nigga, that shit regular to us. Yeah, it's regular. It's regular. It was regular for you to have 10, 15, 20,000 in armrest and shit, five grand on you on the bat on a fucked up day. Niggas, you need another nigga seeing that five thousand on you. Like what? Boy, this nigga got all this money on him. Like yeah, and niggas, like what? You talking about all this money? Cuz <laughs> yeah, bro. Like shit, a lot of shit just don't be regular, bro. And look, cuz went there. Like yeah, we want this whole joint. We right, want the whole joint, dude. The, the niggas had them shaking. I'm like, huh? What the fuck? These niggas talking about the whole joint. Niggas don't do that like this. Right. Niggas don't. Niggas don't even get sections. And I, I bet at that point in time, they wasn't even probably getting sections type shit. <laughs> right. It was a little breeze through if you was on South Street kick. Cause no, that's that. Mirage actually was growing before I was there. Yeah. yeah. We just ain't know nothing about it. Yeah. We wasn't on it. We wasn't yeah. on it. Yeah. Why? I've I been to Mirage like back in the day, but I didn't know what it really was for real. Like, I, I only been, been to been the there. other one up the street. I just know I've been there. It's like every time I went to yeah, Mirage, I, I was getting his fucked his up. Hers? I've been there. Yeah. I've been there. 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 I've Set it off, all types of shit. Like, yeah, that was like back in the, the jungle. jungel, you know, yeah, like, all was, types of dumb ass. Philly be having just all types of furniture stores. Like they be walking over Philly. Like motherfuckers in Canada got start coming like that. That like, start turning this shit into lounges and shit. But that shit gonna get cracked down. So Every fast. time you do it after hours over here, that shit get do it. That shit be nice do it out their house though. Like nah, they be having little spots. I seen niggas do it out of. You know, the same try to do it like over mm-hmm. there. They niggas had it in the auto body shops and Yo. all of that shit. But some that shit you know who got shut nice down real never, fast. Like, so that's another thing. I, that's another yeah. thing too. Like it don't be no drama there, bro. Like that's that's what we gotta highlight too. Like it don't be no drama there, bro. Like you know, like that's why the little after I was I heard on last because it be fucking drama. Nigga get aired out after the drone, like <laughs> and shit. Like, but I don't. It don't really be no drama at Mirage though, cause like it don't. I don't be saying no drama. Like not like. I mean, not too crazy. And yeah, it might be some little, little, little dumb, dumb but not like nothing too crazy. Where like it make you not even want to go back or some shit. Like, you know, we got a nice ass spot in Canada, but I never been inside Booker's. 
Who Booker, is there? Uh, it's downtown. You know uh, Booker's at? Yeah, I went in there a couple times. That shit nice as hell. They got they got crack that joint open for real. Like. Where is it at, cuz? It's on the corner. It's on. It's, it's like on down towards like Sixth Street a little bit. I said Fourth Broadway and Mechanic. Oh, bro, on Broadway right there. Yeah. Oh, he, who, I just commend whoever whoever bought that shit and that did shit, that shit. I remember that. I used to I used to work back there. I was a kid. Yeah, I used to work back there, and I used to go ride. Yeah. That was a band. That whole show was right. was a banded building. So yeah. whoever did that, sh- big up to that them. That was nice that was live as hell for them doing that. Cause like that was a lot of work they did, bro. I remember that shit. Just the big ass corner joint, banded as hell. I'm walking to Man, work and shit. This one shit was fucked up for cause <laughs> shit wasn't always <laughs> shit wasn't always pieces. Till we, we move the whole All right. Are we gonna wrap it up? This is another episode. The Tales of the Hustler. Tales of a Hustler. Coming out, bro. You already know. Appreciate Yo, my boy. Yo, we out. I gotta ask you one question. What's up? Yeah. It's the weather changing. Feel me? <laughs> we, we getting from it? From, you know what I mean? It's just BA. We were talking about that, you know, huh? You know what I mean? We getting. Uh, like, it's in the nature of us. We getting t shirts. We getting. Dude, that's the thing about HBN. We're like, you always going to get something. Yeah. You always going to get something. Yeah. Weather changing. What we doing? And we yeah. definitely yeah. working on something big. So, our yeah. thing is working on. We working on. Uh, so, we want to give y'all good designs, bro. Mm. We always beat that. Say good designs, good quality, good designs. Mm. So, just know the weight is for the good quality and the good design. Yeah. The great designs, bro. Yeah, Great like, design. You know, we, each being in on it, summertime coming, you know that's really like that's when it started. It's about to be seven years. You feel me? So right. like mm-hmm. the summertime, is, I'm chilling. We chilling right now. Like right. it's coming though. We're it's gonna now. be a lot. It's gonna be there. It's gonna be. Yeah. It's gonna be a whole bunch of a whole bunch of a whole bunch for. Right. It's, yeah. it's gonna be that. Cause it's like now to the point where like bro been doing this for a while. I'm just jumping on board. Bro doing this for a while. Like. Right. After one time like that, you know exactly what you now is starting. Like you really know what you want now. You know exactly how to get to it and what you want to do. I'm not in no rush you know what I'm saying? Just knowing, like we not in no rush to just throw out bullshit. A lot of niggas just be like, "Oh, I gotta make something. I gotta make something." And, and in rushing to make it, you don't make it right. Nah, we want you want good. You want great designs and good quality, bro. Yeah, and if, like, it, if you gonna wait for that, I know everybody wait mm-hmm. for that because that's what's going on. You don't want no motherfucking shirt you gonna throw in a washer and that shit gonna be. Yeah, yeah, I ain't tore gonna, up, all right, bro. I got, I got people letters that, off. I got people that walk up to me all the time, and I be seeing motherfuckers that I don't even know, and they be like, "Yo, where the fuck you buy that? I, bro- I dropped that joint like five years ago. What the fuck?" And that shit yeah. still look like a, a, a regular hoodie that they just got. I'm like, that's how I know I got good shit for real. like. Mm-hmm. Cause be like, I, I just five years ago you still got the shirt, you still wear it. Them motherfuckers, I, I know that shit got passed down from hoodie to hoodie to hoodie. I'm like, yeah. I know you ain't buy that joint. Like, yeah, you got that from your uncle. Yeah, uh, they, they, they 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 be telling they be telling uh, me all the time like, you know your shit gonna be hot with it. Uh, it start to get resold, but it's like man, my shit getting passed down in closets, the closets, the closets, and other people wearing. It's like it's, it's gonna be a stable brand for a fact. Like it's already a stable brand in the hood and the people that got it. But I see that shit really being mm-hmm. a worldwide stamp. Like and a, that's like gonna be with these. That's Supreme gonna be with these next couple drops too. Cause like I said, the quality and the the quality and the design is getting better too. So yeah, these next couple drops gonna be crazy. Yeah, so stay tuned. Stay tuned, and you can get it, and you can get it on a site too. What's the mm. site? What's the site name? HBUnited.com. Uh, right, Look out for the events too yeah. coming soon. Yeah. Y'all know what the flyer drop I want to see. I ain't even want to tell them too much for real. I ain't shit, gonna spoil the Limit. We got a promoter here. We can we can link with Cuz, and we can we get some shit. We can link with Cuz to figure some shit out too. Mm-hmm. Like, cause that's the thing where we want niggas to know that like, you can work together, bro. Right. Like niggas can work together, bro. Everything ain't like no yeah, competition. That's what the brand stand for. Like, I hustle united by nature for a fact. What you doing represent what I'm doing. What I do represent you, and it's just that. Like, all right, right. Then. right. It's just that. All right, cuz appreciate you. Appreciate you. Let's wrap this up. That was a good job. Whatever, whatever it is, whatever.